Hi, I'm Chris and today we're taking a look at how to create this toothbrush in just a few clicks if we already have created this carpet. Okay, first we had to structure our data a little bit. That means we have to rename some stuff and get rid of stuff that we don't use. For example, the lights are not necessary, so I will put them out and kick them out of the scene. Then I will rename my data so that I know which is the input, which is the surface where the carpet gets projected on. That's my mesh file and here it's my input of the carpet pieces. And then I will group everything together. Maybe rename also the group and then just save it. Then you can open up a new fresh Maya file, just an empty one. And there we will create a reference to this file with the reference editor. I will link in the tutorial down below. And here I just create a reference to my carpet piece. After the reference is imported, there is the same data structure than in the original file. That means I can use all the data like I used it before. And now I can change the inputs, for example. So for example, I can create a new mesh. That's my new output for the carpet pieces. So I exchanged these one. So first I have to open up the mesh editor and I go down here and just replace this input with my new input file. So here I just have to drag and drop it with the middle mouse button and bam it switches it, uh, the carpet pieces. So now I just had to uh, remember the size of my object so I have to maybe scale down the faces or my object that the carpet piece size fits together. And so all the structure, all the data that I have created here is now copied into the new file. So it means I don't have to do this twice or something like this. I always can rebuild on my old data structure. So let's for example build some toothbrush. Scale it a little bit, detach the surfaces and then like in the last tutorial I just had to remesh the inner side of my toothbrush and change the inputs and so I can pretty fast and pretty easy change the objects that I want to flush with the carpet. Thanks for watching.